Before going for the simulation, we should come to the option that is analysis setup. Under analysis setup, there will be so many different options are there and in those options, we can set some parameters, we can have some various different types of arguments we can set so that our simulation can be done according to our requirement. So, if you come to this analysis setup, we are having this window will come up. So, there are multiple options like your AC sweep where you can change the frequency of the AC source and then load bias point, safe bias point, DC sweep is there where you can change a voltage source, DC voltage source variable from start voltage to end voltage mentioning the increment value. Monte Carlo works case analysis where having this bias point detail, this is the option which will always remain checked and this is the digital setup. Under this one, we are having one option that is flip-flop initialization. So, any kind of digital circuit involving flip-flops, we should come to this option and we should make all flip-flops with zero that is reset initially. So, if you do not do this, then flip-flop oriented digital circuits will not be functioning. So, this option is very important. We are having options, we are having parametric, we are having sensitivity, we are having temperature different components may behave in different temperatures. So, you can have a set of temperatures you can mention and the respective value respective say say resistance value will be varying along with the temperature. So, for different temperatures you can plot the respective characteristic curve and so on. Transfer functions are there. Transient is one of the very important one in our most of the projects we have, we have come to this transient and there we made the respective changes that is the, what is the print step what is the increment and so on. So, all these things are there. So, in the next videos, we will be discussing some of these options into more details because student version of PSPICE obviously is having some limitations. So, all the options may not work up to the full extent. So, depending upon that one, we are having some discussion on some most important uh, setup analysis options are there. So, we will be discussing more on that. So, let us go for one demonstration for the better understanding of this analysis setup window. So, here is the demonstration for you. Before testing any circuit through the simulation process, at first we should go to setup analysis. This setup analysis window can be brought clicking on this icon. Otherwise, we can go to the analysis and you can click on the setup. So, it consists of multiple options. Using these options, we can set parameters for the respective simulation. If you consider DC sweep, then if you click on the DC sweep, then this window will pop up. This DC analysis evaluates circuit performance in response to a direct current source. Steady state voltage and currents when sweeping a source, a model parameter or temperature over a wide range of values. So, in this way, this DC sweep will be used. Also, we can go for nested sweep. We shall give you the detailing in the other videos also. Now, in case of bias point details, this is a bias point detail which will by default remain checked. Bias point data in addition to what is automatically computed in any simulation. Now, let us discuss something about this AC sweep and noise. So, if you click on the AC sweep and noise analysis, then this window will come up and here we are having multiple options and here this AC sweep here can have a starting frequency as well as the ending frequency. Also we can put noise so in that case we shall have to check this one that is the noise enabled. This AC analysis evaluates circuit performance in response to a small signal alternating current source. Small signal response of the circuit linearized around the bias point when sweeping one or more sources over a range of frequencies. Output includes voltage and current with magnitude and phase and the, all these things will get reflected in the simulated output. If we talk about this noise for every frequency specified in the AC analysis, propagated noise contribution at an output net from every noise generator in the circuit. So, in this way, this AC sweep will play a very vital role in our simulation. 
Now we shall go for transient analysis. In case of transient analysis, this particular window will pop up. Here we can have the print step, final time and other parameters. This time-based analysis evaluates circuit performance in response to the time varying sources. So in our most of the experiments, we are using this transient option to set the print step and final time and other parameters. Specifies this software supports multi-run analysis. This multi-run analysis includes parametric, temperature, Monte Carlo and worst case analysis, which results in a series of DC sweep, AC sweep and transit analysis, depending on which basic analysis we can enable. For parametric and temperature analysis, piecewise steps a circuit value in a sequence that you shall mention and runs a simulation for each and every mentioned value. So that is very important for parametric and temperature analysis. So another very important option which we should not miss that is our Monte Carlo and worst case sensitivity analysis. You can find that so many different options are available there. And this Monte Carlo and sensitivity worst case analysis are nothing but they are doing the statistical analysis. Piecewise changes device model parameter values with respect to device and lots of tolerances that you can mention and runs a simulation for each and every value mentioned. For each simulation randomly varies all the device model parameters that we have defined for the tolerance uh, for the tolerance ranges and in this way it is playing a very vital important role in our simulation and analysis so in the next videos we are going to discuss so many other options and all and please watch all of them because those videos will be in the continuation of this one and thanks for watching this